vegan for leaders, cause we cannot say we don't know livestock causes global warming. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Oh mind, vibrate and meditate forever on the Lord. Seek the protection of his sanctuary. If the word of the Guru's Shabbat abides deep within, then you shall not forget the Lord. Please stay with us for this uplifting episode. Swagate, wholehearted viewers. That's how the friendly people of India say welcome to visitors in Punjabi. I am Pranav. The kind Indian people commend your virtuous actions and pray that they uplift you with love and grace from Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji. Compassion and humility, these were the hallmarks of the great enlightened master of Sikhism, Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji. Born in 1469 in today's Punjab, Guru Nanak Dev Ji from an early age sought a deeper connection with the Divine. As a young man, he traveled many thousands of kilometers, mostly on foot, to visit holy places like Mecca and Mount Kailash. At the same time, he shared the unifying concept of one supreme being for all religions. His teachings were simple. Find God within, do honest work, meditate and share with others. Guru Nanak Dev Ji later took up organic farming with harvests that were shared through a free vegetarian community kitchen. The peaceful path of Sikhism has appealed to spiritual seekers around the world. In global communities, many Sikh practitioners continue the noble spiritual lineage of vegetarianism. Supreme Master Ching Hai has spoken on more than one occasion of Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji's wisdom. In a talk given on February 26, 2007 in Sihu, Taiwan, Formosa, she affirmed his spiritual attainment and revealed the mission of his travels. He went to Mecca as a Sikh. A Sikh master, a founder of a great religion, went to Mecca to pay homage to a Muslim's holy shrine. Why does he do that? He's enlightened. Ah, he's enlightened. So, for this we know Guru Nanak definitely is enlightened. Because the first thing uh, an enlightened person gets rid of is discrimination, racism, thinking uh, who is better than whom. Yeah, therefore, this is proof that Guru Nanak is enlightened. And anyone who has no discrimination like that, yeah, between religion, between race, between creeks, between nations, between colors of the skin, between professions, yeah, between uh, education. These are the enlightened people. We now would like to share with you an excerpt of the magnanimous teachings of Sri Guru Nanak Dev Ji from the sacred scriptures known as the Holy Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji. Ang 31 Sri Rag Third mill. Discarding the ambrosial nectar, they greedily grab the poison. They serve others instead of the Lord. They lose their faith. They have no understanding. Night and day they suffer in pain. The blind, self-willed manmuks, egocentric persons, do not even think of the Lord. They are drowned to death without water. O oh mind, vibrate and meditate forever on the Lord. Seek the protection of his sanctuary. If the word of the Guru's Shabbat abides deep within, then you shall not forget the Lord. This body is the puppet of Maya. The evil of egotism is within it. Coming and going through birth and death, the self-willed manmuks, egocentric persons, lose their honor. Serving the true Guru, eternal peace is obtained. 
and one's light merges into the light. Serving the true Guru brings a deep and profound peace, and one's desires are fulfilled. Abstinence, truthfulness, and self-discipline are obtained, and the body is purified. The Lord comes to dwell within the mind. Such a person remains blissful forever, day and night, meeting the Beloved, peace is found. I am a sacrifice to those who seek the sanctuary of the true Guru. In the court of the true one, they are blessed with true greatness. They are intuitively absorbed into the true Lord. O Nanak, by his glance of grace, he is found. The Guru Muk, God Consciousness Being, is united in his union. Sri Rag, Third Mill The self-willed Manmuk, egocentric person, performs religious rituals like the unwanted bride decorating her body. Her husband Lord does not come to her. Day after day she grows more and more miserable. She does not attain the mansion of his presence. She does not find the door to his house. O siblings of destiny, meditate on the Nam with one-pointed mind. Remain united with the society of the saints. Chant the name of the Lord and find peace. The Guru Muk, God Consciousness Being, is the happy and pure soul bride forever. She keeps her husband Lord enshrined within her heart. Her speech is sweet and her way of life is humble. The happy and pure soul bride is noble. She has infinite love for the Guru. By perfect good fortune, one meets the true Guru when one's destiny is awakened. Suffering and doubt are cut out from within and peace is obtained. One who walks in harmony with the Guru's will shall not suffer in pain. The Amrit, the ambrosial nectar, is in the Guru's will. With intuitive ease it is obtained. Those who are destined to have it, drink it in. Their egotism is eradicated from within. O Nanak, the Guru Muk, God Consciousness Being, meditates on the Nam and is united with the True Lord. Sri Rag, Third Mill If you know that He is your husband Lord, offer your body and mind to Him. Behave like the happy and pure soul bride. With intuitive ease, you shall merge with the True Lord and He shall bless you with true greatness. O siblings of destiny, without the Guru, there is no devotional worship. Without the Guru, devotion is not obtained, even though everyone may long for it. The soul bride in love with duality goes around the wheel of reincarnation through 8.4 million incarnations. Without the Guru, she finds no sleep and she passes her life night in pain. Without the Shabbat, she does not find her husband Lord, and her life wastes away in vain. Ang 32 Practicing egotism, selfishness, and conceit, she wanders around the world, but her wealth and property will not go with her. The spiritually blind do not even think of the Nam. They are all bound and gagged by the messenger of death. Meeting the true Guru, the wealth is obtained. Contemplating the name of the Lord in the heart, those who are attuned to the Nam are immaculate and pure. Through the Guru they obtain intuitive peace and poise. Their minds and bodies are dyed in the color of the Lord's love, and their tongues savor His sublime essence. O Nanak, that primal color which the Lord has applied shall never fade away. Sri Rag, Third Mill By His grace one becomes Gurumuk, a God-consciousness being, worshipping the Lord with devotion. Without the Guru there is no devotional worship. Those whom He unites with Himself understand and become pure. The dear Lord is true, and true is the word of His Bani, holy text. Through the Shabbat we merge with Him. O siblings of destiny, those who lack devotion, 
Why have they even bothered to come into the world? They do not serve the perfect Guru. They waste away their lives in vain. The Lord Himself, the life of the world, is the giver of peace. He Himself forgives and unites with Himself. So what about all these poor beings and creatures? What can anyone say? He Himself blesses the Gurumukh, God consciousness being with glory. He Himself enjoins us to His service. Gazing upon their families, people are lured and trapped by emotional attachment. But none will go along with them in the end. Serving the true Guru, one finds the Lord, the treasure of excellence. His value cannot be estimated. The Lord God is my friend and companion. God shall be my helper and support in the end. Within your conscious mind, you may say anything, but without the Guru, selfishness is not removed. The dear Lord is the giver, the lover of His devotees. By His grace, He comes to dwell in the mind. O Nanak, by His grace, He bestows enlightened awareness. God Himself blesses the Gurumu, God Consciousness Being, with glorious greatness. Pure-spirited viewers, we are gladdened by your company on today's Words of Wisdom. Please join us tomorrow for more from the holy text of Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji. May you know your soul's inner truth in heavenly peace and understanding. There's nothing more powerful than an idea whose time has come, and this veganism is it, and it's only going to get bigger from here. Crystal Force Vegan. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash W-O-W. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com bar oblique schedule et suprememastertv.com bar oblique W-O-W. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com bar inclinada schedule y suprememastertv.com bar inclinada W-O-W. Mana nitrudut olen hiller kartak zashle khayk Supreme Master TV Tikom tashe zoras schedule. Bazen Supreme Master TV Tikom tashe zoras W O W.